Oh, hey. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. Let's say hello to Mr. John Baptiste. Hello, John. <laughs> you Good got your say... arm, would you say? John Baptiste, everybody. <laughs> Thank you, John. Yeah, baby. You know, I spent a lot of time tanning the finest leather from the most topical cattle. Meticulously dip dyeing in a solution of the day's biggest stories, then hand cutting and stitching it into the must have Louis Vuitton handbag that is my monologue. But once in a while, I scour my backyard for a damp stick, tie a blood stained bandana I got from a biker named Barracuda to it with trinkets, can of beans, and what might be a human thumb to create the foul hobo bindle of news that is my segment. Quarantine Wild. Q Wild. The Navy's new USS Ford is having some problems. Apparently, the most expensive aircraft carrier ever built cannot launch fighter jets. Let me fix that headline for you. Navy launches $13 billion houseboat. They've been trying to get it to work for years, but the testers said the trouble was with the USS Ford's new high-tech aircraft takeoff and landing systems and electromagnetic catapult and catch system that keeps breaking. I gotta say, even if you do manage to get this thing up and running, it's gonna be a tough sell to those pilots. Uh, Alpha 6, Tango, you have permission to land your 50,000-pound jet on the electromagnetic plane catcher thingy that snaps every so often, but it's all good now. Come on in at angle zero, not, and he ejected. Okay, thank you. I don't know why they're talking to their hands. <laughs> Quarantine while Philips has a new smart toothbrush that adapts as you brush the Philips Sonicare 9900 Prestige with Sense IQ uses artificial intelligence to detect how much pressure you're exerting and then will adjust the intensity automatically, and it works with the Philips Sonicare app to give you Real-time guidance on pressure, motion, position, duration, and frequency. Or, you could brush your teeth. <laughs> Quarantine while well, Mercedes-Benz announced that it will introduce an electric sedan with a mammoth pillar-to-pillar 56-inch -pillar touchscreen, which Mercedes calls the hyperscreen, because the term collision generator 9000 was already taken. When it debuts in late 2021, drivers will be looking at a screen nearly five feet across that provides various infotainment, comfort, and vehicle functions. Hey, you know what's super compelling infotainment to watch while you're driving? The road. It may start slow, but true fans of watching the road know that if you stick with it, spoiler, you don't die. <laughs> and it's in 3D. Quarantine while. The hippest thing on TikTok right now is sea shanties. I called this last year, as I said last night. John, are you aware that 2021 is the year of the sea shanty? I've been telling people <laughs> this. I told my whole family this over the Christmas break. Like, Dad, you're crazy. Get it's off the grog <laughs> and come back to port. No one is going to listen to sea shanties. And now they're, they're blowing up online. Now, before I go on with this vital story, parents, a warning. Sea shanties are a gateway to much more dangerous online maritime influence behavior, like wearing cable knit sweaters and carving scrimshaw penis pics. <laughs> For those of you not up on the young folks lingo, sea shanties are old whalers and merchant vessel folk songs. And since TikTok allows users to layer on each other's videos, you get awesome stuff like this. She had not been two weeks from shore when down on her a right whale bore. The captain called all hands and swore he'd take, take that, that whale, whale in tow. Soon may the weatherman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. Hey! My ears are blessed with a TikTok meme, a sailor song, this is my dream. The kids are doing some internet stuff, I finally understand. Hey, soon may another meme come, a staffer will show me and I'll say, um, what is that? It's making me mad, they'll say whatever, dad. We'll be right back with the co-hosts of Showtime's The Circus, Alex Wagner, John Heilman, and Mark McKinnon are. Soon may the well come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. <laughs>